explain this to me, how the Black Lives Matter protesters got hurt really badly and some got killed. And you know, white supremacists can get all the way into the Capitol because they support Trump? What the fuck? You want to know what institutional racism looks like? It looks like this shit right there. If that was Black Lives Matter doing that, there would be rubber bullets in the air. Tear gas would have been sprayed. There'd be attack dogs. There'd be militarized cops everywhere. And most likely dead black bodies all over the ground. But instead, they just let them take over the Capitol. What, because they're white? Because they're Trump supporters? This is what tyranny looks like. This is what fascism looks like. This is what it looks like when you have a president who's been lying his ass off for four years and all of his idiot supporters have been drinking it up like it's mother's milk. The media needs to stop calling them protesters. They're not protesters. They are terrorists. They are white domestic terrorists. This man is stealing a podium from the Capitol building and he was not shot. This woman is sitting at a congressional desk that is not hers and she's not getting shot. This man broke into Speaker Nancy Pelosi's office and has his feet up on her desk. Next to his feet, he put a note, we will not back down. If you've ever wondered what white privilege is, it's this. Well, they've done it. Pieces of shit have stormed the Capitol with guns. Why don't the fucking cops shoot these white motherfuckers? Tell me that. Bunch of fucking seditious assholes. Fuck Trump. Fuck all these people. Hope they all die. I don't care if you're pro-Trump, pro-Biden. I don't give a fuck what you stand for. America, you are a disgrace to the world right now. I don't care if you're on CNN, Fox, Breitbart, who you are a publicist for. This is an embarrassment to the world. You guys will never recover from this. This is shameful that you allow this to happen. Unfucking believable that you let protesters in to the Capitol during Congress time trying to verify Biden. And I wouldn't care if it was Biden or Trump. This is disgraceful. You guys should be so embarrassed. The United States of America is the laughing stock of this planet. And you will never, ever be forgotten for the shameful acts that are happening right now in your pathetic fucking country.